I'll show you how to track your body measurements. If you open up True Coach, it will go most likely to the workouts tab and you want to go to the profile. So the bottom right profile icon. Now we want to go to metrics. That second in the list metrics is what you track any number. For this one, it starts out with body composition. It has the body weight in pounds, fat percentage, and remainder uh, metrics to track for the body composition. Also, for some of my big lifts, I have things like a bench press, one rep max, back squat. So really anything that you want to track, it could be anything at all, that is tracked in the metrics folder. So I'll show you, for example, how to track the body weight. Click body weight, and you can see all my previous measurements all graphed out March 20th, March 25th, and you can always check these in the graphs. They're all down at the bottom too. So to add a result, click add result, and I'll input March 20th, sorry, April 20th again, 196.4, and April 20th. If you're tracking for a previous date, for example, April 13th, put that in, save, and it will go back to April 13th, 196.4 pounds. Now, I've already input for that day, so I'll delete that. But these end up tracking in the graph, and after your body weight, you can input others. So next one in line would be fat percentage. Click fat percentage, and same thing, they're all graphed out. So I can see my progress. March 20th, I'm 18.3% body fat. Now, April 19th, April 20th, I'm 17.4. So you can see the difference between all these measurements. Anytime you add a new metric, add result, punch in the number, and the current date is always up first. If it's for the current date, just leave it, save, and there it is.